English Language Essentials Understanding Full Page Spread Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're going to dive into an interesting phrase that you might come across in English, full page spread. This term is commonly used in publishing and media, and understanding it can really enhance your comprehension of English in these contexts. Let's get started. A full page spread refers to a layout in magazines, newspapers, or books where content, like text, images, or both, extends across two facing pages. This format is often used for maximum impact, drawing the reader's attention with large, eye-catching visuals or detailed information. It's a popular choice for feature articles, advertisements, or photo essays. Let's look at some examples to understand how a full page spread is used. 1. Magazines. Fashion magazines often use full page spreads for high impact fashion photography. 2. Newspapers. Major news stories sometimes get a full page spread, especially if they're accompanied by large photos or infographics. 3. Books. In coffee table books, especially those focused on photography or art, Full page spreads showcase the visual content beautifully. Understanding the concept of a full page spread is crucial for several reasons. Visual impact. It signifies the importance or the appeal of the content featured. Advertising. In advertising, a full page spread is often a premium choice due to its size and impact. Graphic design. For those interested in graphic design or publishing, knowing this term is essential. When you're reading a magazine or a book, look out for these clues to identify a full page spread. Continuity across pages, the content seamlessly spans across two facing pages. Centerfold, sometimes, a full page spread is also referred to as a centerfold, especially in magazines. Size and layout. The content appears larger and more prominent than regular single-page content. That's all about full-page spreads. We hope this video has been informative and helps you understand this term better. Whether you're interested in publishing, graphic design, or just enhancing your English vocabulary, knowing phrases like this can be really beneficial. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more English language learning content.